Hey, how's it going, guys? It's Crafty Fox of Minecraft Military Force, and today we're going to be building the M104 Wolverine Heavy Assault Bridge. So, this design is by An Easy Leaf. You may have remembered it from our Making the Entire U.S. Army of Minecraft video. So, I also did modify it since then, so it looks a lot different and it's supposed to be uh, more accurate. So, yeah, in real life, this is used by the U.S. Army of Engineers, and then uh, they lay bridges, so this is what it would look like. If you're carrying like um, Abrams tanks over, they need like a really heavy duty bridge. So I think this is actually our first US Army combat engineering vehicle. And um, yeah, let's get started on this build. So the first thing we want to do, let's uh, build the chassis. So let's go down here and let's place down a sandstone slab. And let's make that hovering above the ground three blocks wide. All right. And then um, we're going to make it uh, nine blocks long. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You know what? Let's make it 10 and extend the rest. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Fill in the middle. And then we're going to fill in the corners using um, stone brick slabs like this. And the inside part, let's add the wheel. So that's uh, one gray wool in the front. Stone brick slab down there. And then gray wool for the rest. So it's all the way back and it goes up diagonally by one. That's the back wheel. And, all right, so next we're gonna add the wooden buttons on the sides. I'm gonna use birch since that's sandstone color and that's what it, they have in real life, they have like 10 color wheels. And after we do that, let's go add a smooth sandstone. And we're going to have that from the back towards the back wheel like this. And then we're going to have a little bit of a row in the front of three. So let's fill it. Actually, let's just fill in the entire middle area with it. All the way across, unless you're going to be building an interior. You don't really need stuff here. And the back, uh, we're going to have a bedrock in the middle. Smooth sandstone on either side, and then sandstone slabs at the very edge. And this back section, we're going to have um, sandstone stairs in the middle, facing the back. Let's also add uh, ladders back vents and um, a birch trap door under here like so all right so on this side there's gonna be like this box so let's add that that's gonna be two smooth sandstone blocks with a sandstone stairs in the front and then we're gonna have sandstone slabs uh, let's add a two by four on this side and the middle part that's where the arms gonna be so I'm gonna try to like skip that area so for the rest just try to match it up just don't fill in the middle yet and then we're also gonna have um, birch trap doors two of them in the front of that for both sides and the front, let's add this uh, tread, so that's going to be uh, upside down stone brick stairs with a pressure plate on top. This is birch pressure plate. And we're also going to have this part, which is birch trap doors. And little arms, so that's going to be a cobblestone wall. Either side, the middle is actually going to be a sandstone stairs. And in front of that, we're going to have like that plow of a sandstone stairs five blocks wide. And this is what it goes down when they're laying the bridge to make it stable. So after you do that, let's add in um, this bit of detail right here. So there's like a skeleton skull and then a birch trap door and a birch fence gate that's opened up. All right. So skeleton skull, uh, birch trap door. And then uh, open birch fence gate, facing the inside. 
And then a skeleton skull again. Uh, two birch fences. Alright. I think that's it for this side. Now let's look on the other side. There's going to be um, this area in the back. So let me try to do that. So dark prism marine slab and a sandstone in the middle. And there's two more birch shot doors right here. And in front of that, we're going to skip a block and add a sandstone slab with um, fence gates, birch fence gates on the side and the front of that. That's opened up. All right. So now let's add a little bit of a side detail. So let's add dark oak wood uh, button in near the front. And stone button uh, adjacent to this chap door. And then skip a block, add another one in front of that. So it looks like this. All right, so yeah, that's our chassis. Now let's add in the arm. So it kind of looks like that. Um, so to do that, Let's see where we're going to start. We're going to add smooth sandstone blocks. And let's make it so it lines up with this uh, fence gate right here. So just add smooth sandstone all the way to that fence gate on this side. And from that, we're going to add uh, upside down sandstone stairs. And then two sandstone slabs. And then two birch trap doors and yeah I think that's it so let's work on the back so that that's gonna be smooth sandstone two blocks like this and then the sandstone stairs and a sandstone slab all right in front of that there's gonna be a sandstone slab <clears throat> skip a block and there is an upside down sandstone stairs facing the front There is also this thing in the front, so that's um, right above this upside down sandstone stairs. There's another upside down one, but it's facing backwards. And then there's smooth sandstone in front of that, all the way to the end where the trap door ends. Let's add another smooth sandstone and an upside down sandstone stairs. Oh yeah, I almost forgot to add this, but we're going to add a skeleton skull to the back. All right, so now let's add in um, the actual bridge. So this is what it kind of looks like when it doesn't have anything on it, or you can add in like that, on which we're going to do later for the bridge. So um, to do that, we're going to have, you know what, let's start from this front area. So we're going to have sandstone slab, and let's add it on um, two to each side like this. Then we're going to make it at least the outer edge 18 blocks long so one two three four five six seven eight and I missed that one eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen so if you did that right it should line up with that one let's do the other side as well all right cool and then we're gonna have to do the inner part so we're gonna do that but I'm gonna leave a gap of space since there's like this weird thing with the minecraft lighting if you cover it all the way up it kind of messes up with some stuff so first just do all the way across and I'm gonna show you what to do yeah you can see that like little dark spot I don't really like that so we can remove that uh, by removing these two slabs right here. So that's going to be lined up with that slab down here. So that slab, just remove two from each side like that. And then it, it appears to be better, although there's still like that dark patch. If you really want to, you can remove it like that, but I don't know. I don't want to remove too much. Yeah, let's work in the front a bit so there's going to be like this uh, two gray carpets in the front both sides and then there's going to be like a two by 
is this yeah two by two both sides of sandstone uh, slabs behind it sandstone stairs facing the front and uh, we're gonna go to the back and we're gonna have like these two upside down sandstone stairs facing each other and you want to make sure it's like uh, two holes in Leaf's design there was no hole at all but I added that alright so it looks like that now and then we can also add in birch uh, fence gate like that so I'm gonna crouch down to place another fence gate on top of it and let's make that face outwards and let's add another fence gate but uh, one block backwards diagonally so uh, how are we gonna do this I'm gonna place blocks temporarily just so I can place it there so it looks like that and it's gonna face inwards like that alright cool so um, hmm I think we have to do something about the middle area or maybe not actually we're gonna do that later so next thing we're gonna do let's add uh, this upside down sandstone stairs and that's gonna be a block of space in between that and the other one so skip that one add upside down stairs here face in the back and did I do that side yes I did alright cool so back to this part we're gonna have uh, two upside down sandstone stairs facing each other right here just like we, what we did in the back we're going to do in the front so like that we have like these two nice holes and we're going to add a sandstone slabs two blocks each side and we're going to make it so it's 17 blocks long so 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 same thing on the other side and I'm just gonna like try to match it up so I don't have to count anymore alright and let's make it two blocks wide all the way back and this side same thing All right, now we have to um, make the like this middle area. So you can see like there's like an inner wall. So that's a smooth sandstone block. It's gonna start right after this stairs, and it's gonna end at the stairs as well. So just do like the inner part of it. Um, let me check if it's the top and the bottom. Yeah, pretty much. So let's start it off right here, two blocks tall, all the way across. And the other side, same exact thing. Alright, cool. And then in the back, we're going to make that, just extend that by one like that. Alright, cool. So, now we can add in like this little like line that goes across towards the back so actually we need to add in this sandstone stairs uh, diagonally to this one right here two on each side like that and a sandstone two by two right there and we can add a gray carpet right there at the edge and now we can add the line art so <laughs> there's gonna be let me count one two three five so there's going to be five slabs from the back so one two three four five then go down diagonally another slab and make that one uh four blocks so one two three four down diagonally again and it just goes all the way like that so let's do the same thing on the other side so five and four so one two three four five go down one two three four go down and all the way across towards the stairs so it should look like that now we're going to add it in some detail so it looks nice so there's going to be a birch wooden button in this little corner 
And another one right here, just like skip a block of space. And there is a birch fence gate. And we're going to do the same thing on the other side. So one in this corner, and then skip a block of space, add another button, and a fence gate. So towards the back, we're going to have skip these two blocks, add a fence gate, and a birch button. Skip these two blocks, uh, fence gate, birch button. All right, cool. Now it's uh, getting together quite nicely. Now we need to add in like these bars um, in the middle. Originally there was like end rods, but I don't think that really fit. It was way too skinny looking. So to do that, we need to add it. Um, how are we gonna do this actually? You know what? We need to add in this these four um, birch trap doors. I'm gonna skip three blocks in the front. Skip these three, one, two, three, and then add four trap doors like that. So the bars in the back, we're gonna go down here. And you see like this edge part, we're gonna skip these two and add a sandstone slab. Skip a block, add another one, and another one until we have four. So you see there are four of them, one block of space in between. And the four in the front, we're gonna skip these two blocks here on top. Add sandstone slab. Skip one, another one till we have four. So it should look like that. And we're also gonna add a birch trap door just to make it a bit thicker, like that. So it sticks out a little bit on top. So yeah, that's what it looks like. And the one on the bottom, I can't do it because it's just like a slab. So. so yeah, that's how you make the M104 Wolverine Heavy Assault Bridge. Now to uh, actually deploy it, if you wanna do that, basically you remove the bridge so you're left like with this arm and you wanna tilt this a little bit backwards and this is what it looks like if you wanna deploy it. So um, what we're gonna do is add uh, sandstone stairs like this. I'm just gonna copy like from this side and you're just gonna flip it all the way around. So sandstone stairs uh, facing each other like that and a sandstone slab and we're gonna make it um, 17 blocks long. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. And then we're gonna have smooth sandstone on the inside part like that all the way across, except the back part, we're just gonna leave that alone. Add a sandstone slab right here. And then there's gonna be uh, three sandstone and then five sandstone slabs. So one, two, three, go up at five. One, two, three, four, five. And then there's a smooth sandstone again. So smooth sandstone, you can go all the way to the front, except the actual front. <laughs> uh, the actual front, we're gonna have sandstone uh, slabs like that. I'm gonna make a solid block, add another, slab on top. All right, so for this part, it's gonna be five or four. It is four slabs, so one, two, three, four, and then goes up, and just fill in the rest. Then we're gonna add in this uh, wooden button and the birch fence gate like that. So yeah, now we're gonna add in like this little bar in the middle, so just skip two blocks, add one, Skip one, add one until we have four. So there's four right there. Cool. And then we're just gonna do copy basically like the same thing of this on the other side and that's how you make um, it deployed. And then you would have to like flip it the other way. So it looks like this. And you could fit a tank, like an Abrams tank on there. It should fit. And that's what it's used for in real life. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And thanks again to Lee for making the original design for this build. And if you guys like this video, remember to hit that like button down below because that really helps grow the channel. And subscribe if you haven't already because I will be uploading more videos like this in the future. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.